it's really nice. We've got the best of both worlds because we've got the coast and the hills. Beautiful area and a really nice place to live. Well, I'm a very active person, so I love the mountains, I love the lakes. Equally, I'm still a young person. I like to go to the city, have social time. Carlisle itself is a pretty vibrant, uh, interesting city with lots of different things to do. Well, the walking, of course, is fantastic. Uh, a lot of great country pubs. Cumbia is a good place to bring up your children. There's good schools, there's affordable housing, it's a safe place. Crime rate is obviously low. It's a brand new hospital, so it's really well designed and a lovely place to work. Oh, the people are great, uh, they're very warm. So I started my nurse training in this trust in 2002, did my degree and then my master's in nurse practitioners and I've just finished my critical care practitioner training, so I'm now filling in a slot on the medical rota. I'm from the Philippines, uh, Manila. Nursing-wise, it, well, it was an adventure, really. That experience led me to stay. Before I moved here, I was paramedic in Poland. Northwest Ambulance Service helped me with that change to meet all HCPC standards and on my induction course. I found very good friends here and colleagues. As an armory reservist in a medical regiment, I run the multi-cat badge unit here in Carlisle. Lake District down the road, brilliant climbing. All our main training areas are local. So I've been a paramedic for four years. I just became a senior paramedic. I have um, done, my, I said, done my diploma at university and I'm hoping to start my BSc honours which will be funded by the service as part of my role. We have a real good morale on station and work with a real good bunch of people. There's a real good support network there, especially for new staff. And Cumbria, perhaps uh, more than other parts of the country, has the opportunity for GPs to branch out into different areas of work. I myself work as an Associate Medical Director for the Community Services, but also work as a GP uh, two days a week in Carlisle. We offer sponsorship for GPs who've trained in the UK and who need sponsorship to stay and remain in the UK. The hospital does have some good opportunities up and coming, especially from an, uh, an advanced practice point of view. We are pushing different streams of practice in order to fill medical roles, which hasn't really been done elsewhere before. We also have um, a big cohort of trainee physician associates, a new post, relatively new in this country. We just had our um, authorisation for our first paediatric rotational post. When physios first qualify, they often haven't had any paediatric experience. What we're hoping this will do is increase their paediatric knowledge and encourage people into uh, coming to paediatrics in the first place. We have exciting developments that are taking place with new university, University of Central Lancashire, and there are opportunities for research, opportunities for teaching, opportunities to make changes in the area to, to the benefit of uh, our patients. My ambition is to be the best, not just in this country, but in the world, in rural and remote medicine. We have dedicated staff in research departments in all the Cumbrian NHS Trust. We actually work with uh, more than five different companies from both the UK, Sweden and the United States, where we do research in Cumbria basically a world first research with various uh, medical devices and they're being tested with Cumbrian patients. A sort of a much smaller trust than other places but that means that you can really get your teeth into new developments and helping improve services you know in a way that you you really wouldn't get the opportunity in much larger sort of big tertiary centres. If you are new and looking for your first job Cumbria is the best because you are coming to a place where there is a lot of mentoring and coaching going on. Whenever I've got an idea for improving things, um, I've never come up against a no. I've always been asked intelligent questions and been supported to try and make a difference. I think there are unique opportunities here for people in elderly medicine who are interested in community work, frailty work, to do some really innovative things. In a rural setting, you can make a difference. Don't just come to Cumbria for a holiday, come to stay.